Hello all and welcome back. Today we are going to be testing out three more uh, maps that have zero ratings that show up on the Steam Work Workshop and see if they actually are good or if they're, they have no ra ratings for a good reason. Our first, so now we have three maps select selected like I said and let's get in and I'll get back and I will see you guys once it loads. Okay we have our first map loaded. I'll link it down in the description. It'll, probably, it'll be the first link. It is blank. Looks like this is just a height map. The highway is just two exits. Um, do they at least have like they said that this would be a blank map in the description, but let's check. There's absolutely no, not a single resource. There's not any resources in this map. Okay, that's some nice variety, although they didn't customize that, but since. But that, that, that works, that's good, that's good. But the, since this is a height map, the train is also like pretty much all flat. Don't know what you would do in this world. Um, yeah, like I don't know. There's um, uh, transportation. Yeah, they have the. They don't have any modes of transportation, like at all. The highway, so, uh, to sum up what I just said in the last minute, they don't have anything that, like, other than the height map, like, the size, I'm guessing this is the height map, they don't have much, like, they, it's just a blank road, nothing, there is absolutely nothing in here, nothing, um, now, yeah, there's no trees, they, I mean, maybe you could do, get creative and, like, turn this to something, but honestly, I don't see where you, anyone would want to, um, so yeah, not my, not my favorite map, um, so, yeah, let's go on to the next map. Okay, so here we are in this new map, right off the bat, it is very pretty terrain, although it is kind of jagged, but it has really nice landscape, I like this. Not much variety in the tree, they just used one brush for the whole tree, all the trees. They could have tried to improve that, but honestly that's a pretty good bridge over the river. Here we have another, uh, the bridge actually is not the best because it cuts over where, right where they intersect. They could have like drawn the bridge that way more so because it's kind of weird that you have like the intersection of the river and like that, that's like the longer area, seems like that would be more expensive. Um, Let's just buy this entire island, because we can, and so let's just check it out. I already see lots of ships around too that you can see, which is good. Um, oops. Um, the row... <laughs> they could have definitely fixed that really easily, like that highway, they just made like that. Yeah, I also... The highway I'm not liking as much anymore because it's all elevated. At least they had like a synchronized bridge here, but even then the pillars are like right in the middle of the river, which uh, I don't know, it's just not a very, they could have done better with that. I do like the use of all the little rivers and they have like a little waterfall and like a giant gorge. That's pretty cool. You could build like a city here. Um, the terrain just needs to be a little bit smoother in like the areas where they intend to be one. Like this is a good area, although it's high off since if I was to build like a, a cruise port, right? Well, look how high off that is to the ground. That wouldn't make much sense and would be... Yeah, like the cruise ship is like right there. And you can't... It wouldn't make sense how you'd get on to the... Sh uh, to the ship and off the ship. Now, so the island has a, a nice, like, organic shape, 
like I said, the highway could have been improved, although they have a, they have a train route. I like that kind of curved bridge for the train. That's cool. We see some more highway work. They have a nice intersection. Let's let's check that out as well. So yeah, I like how they have this. How they kind of like expand this, but the bridge all the way through everything is kind of takes away from the realistic essence of it. I think they just didn't want to work work with terraforming. Also, this this bridge dice, they need to be in line. This uh, intersection, it's custom made, which I appreciate, but you can go from this one to that one, this one to But you can't go from this one to that one. So yeah, it's not the best designed one. They, You can see the like skeletons of the things. This is, is this a river? No, that's not a river, it's just a little weird bay. Um, that's fine. Um, yeah, I actually like this map. It has like a nice, it has a nice little points and stuff. You could build something really cool here. Um, apart from a little, you could, they could have smoothed out the terrain a little bit because it's just in linear ridges. Also, yeah, it's nice that they have some like <laughs> roads that like, uh, our entryway, that's like an entryway on this side, so like if you wanted to have perhaps build like a mega bridge across that'd be pretty cool although it's hard to build on most of it because the terrain is so rigid although it is a very pretty map I like this although despite the rigidness and the highways let's check on the transportation we have sh a lots of cruise ship what I like a lot of like uh, we have planes let's check natural resources ooh that's a I like I like how it makes sense, like these natural resources make sense, like in the mountains, or in the, well, of course in the forest, there's no, there's very little farmland as you can see here, and no oil, which, oh there's some farmland right here, but no oil, and at least, but the nice thing is that you can like start off with, with whatever you want, like in the starting square, like you can build your city in the starting square, it's nice, um, which is right here, um, and so yeah, there's like a room to build a small city, then you, once you build that, you can expand. But if you zoom out, you can see the linear ridges in the mountains. And that uh, honestly is not my favorite, although some may like it, but that's a, just a very vanilla aspect of the map, because like they just, just kind of built the terrain up. I like this kind of like bay in the island. Um, let's just check the fishing industry just to see if it's... Uh, so yes, lots of shellfish, shellfish in the ocean. Yeah, this makes sense. Um, yeah, I wish they might. They could have uh, created a more gradual shore, which would have helped with like that steepness of off the into the, the from the land into the ocean, but also increased a more anchovy fishing area. Although they may not have been thinking that, which is fine. I li but overall, the, I really do like this map. It has it shows it. They're not many uh, winter maps, winter themed maps, like in the workshop and I like how they use so many rivers and it, it looks really cool. So yeah, I like this map better than the last one. And now let's get on to our final map. Okay, here we are with our final map. This map uh, actually looks really good, like honestly, it has like a really cool castle it has like a nice bay this looks like one of the vanilla maps like that the it has like nice little rivers I could actually I would actually play on this map like if all the other things are nice on it like the or distribution let's check out the highways but this map is looking really nice I think this map is totally worthy and I don't understand why it has zero views it was published today it does not have a thumbnail, which is a big problem, because nobody knew that this map exists. It, it, look at that, that, that's so cool, it even has like a volcano, <laughs> with that, with, even with like a little cave in it, it's so cool. Um, now let's actually check out the highways, the highways this highway system looks decent, yeah, this highway system is like actually not bad, they, they even have their rail with the highway. 
and the rail goes the nice patterns nice smooth always together make the bridge make sense yes yes now yeah, this map is really lovely yeah I don't know why this map doesn't have more reviews other than just not enough popularity uh, but it has as you can see it, they did run out of trees because they did not use unlimited trees mod and so that might have been one of their problems, but they made they hit it pretty well. Um, or maybe they did this on purpose that like you have like a little thing. I like how you there's like rivers and whatnot. It's really pretty. Um, let's check out the ore distribution. Nice, nice, nice. I like to see that you get to lots of ore in all different places. The spawn does not have any, however, and but the relic the surrounding. Uh, if you are playing in absolutely vanilla city skylines, this um, might not be exactly practical because you can't get all the resources. I like this little kill, by the way. Um, let's go back to the resource panel. Uh, they are also very clumped together, so that does make the terrain look a little weird. Like they could have faded it in a little bit more. But the placements of the uh, natural resources are nice. Like makes sense on the on there but you also have a place to build it lots of farmland is nice um trees as well and i like how they kind of like made like a little bit more clearings and stuff this map is yeah my favorite map out of all these um i just picked this map randomly like i did it with all the other maps and i am super glad i chose to do it like it has like this cool little natural feature there like it makes sense why because like I don't know like some erosion made this river happen a little lake starts the river so this map makes very much sense let's check the transportation actually yeah I don't know what to criticize about this map it's amazing I like it all very much um there's no reason uh yeah there's nothing I'd really criticize about this other than a little bit about the ore distribution the rail, like, look at that, that looks so nice. Um, you do need the transportation mod. Ooh, look, they even had the markings. They bothered to put some markings in there, which looks nice. Um, just makes it look a lot better. Um, although you will need the mods for, for that to work, I think. Um, yeah, this hot, this interchange looks nice. Everything about this map looks nice. They have, like, you could tell they spent a lot of time and effort on, in this, on this, and I think it paid off, because... This is my favorite map out of all of them, uh, and so yeah, I think this is my favorite, yeah, this is my favorite map that I've rated so far out of all the six maps that I've rated. Um, yeah, and I might actually even, like, do something on this map, like, play on it, because honestly, yeah, um, it looks really fun to use, and yeah, so I will see you guys uh in the next video hopefully and uh if you're new here subscribe and uh yeah uh, like because yeah i don't know helps some or something and um yeah i hope to see you guys soon yeah also i will list all these in their numerical order so like the first map will be the first link the second map will be second link and so on um and yeah, if you like these videos, uh, make sure to like, uh, tell me to do more of these. And yeah, see you next time.